टुडे आई वांट टू गो टू टीच सिक्स सेमिस्टर मैथमेटिक्स एफ आई तो कॉम्प्लेक्स एनालिसिस लेक्चर टू बाय डॉक्टर पीर हामलू हेड डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ मैथमेटिक्स एम बी एस गवर्नमेंट ओर्स एंड साइंस कॉलेज महबूबनगर यूनिट टू यूनिट थ्री लेट एफ ऑफ जी बेड लेट एफ ऑफ जेड बी एनालिटिक फंक्शन ऑन क्लोज कॉन्ट्रोल सी एंड द कॉन्ट्रोल सी इज एनक्लोज बाई ऑर इफ आई टेक लाइक दिस सो लेट बी चेक वोट है For this, I am taking that uh, z equal to z of t, and uh, where t lies between a less than equal to t less than equal to b. D z equal to what happen if I z equal to z of t? D z equal to z of t t theta. Here my contour C is enclosed by region or. Okay, so oh, I am considering integration over C f of z d z. That equal to t a to T A to B F of J D J F of J nothing but J of T D J nothing but J S of D T. Okay, and I'm one day in that F of J equal to U of X comma Y plus I V of X comma Y J equal to X plus I Y. So my function is in terms of theta. If I take J equal to X plus Y Y, which nothing but J of T equal to X of T plus I V of T. J D S R P what happen? X D S R P plus I V D S. That means I want to derive this function with respect to t. I want to multiply f of J J D S R P theta. If I multiply both, uh, we will get uh, this expression: U X D S minus V Y D S plus I V X D S plus U Y D S. So now I am taking integration f of J D J. What is f of J into G J? So f of J in D J. If I multiply, we will get this, right? Uh, Here I am taking that in terms of theta. Here J is happy right? D J nothing but uh, D J by D T. So if I multiply f of J D J equal to this, so T T goes to this side. So integration it will be this will equal to this. So uh, here x nothing but D X by D T. Y nothing but D Y by D T. X uh, D T D T cancel out. We will get uh, this expression. So now I want to apply to the store. For uh, Green's theorem, what is uh, Green's theorem says? So if f of x comma y, q of x comma y passes first order partial derivative. So on enclosed region R, by Green's theorem, we know that integration over C, p d x plus q d y equal to double integration over R, dou q by dou x minus dou q by dou y d x d y. Here d x d y d a and uh, dou q by dou x by q x. So uh, dou q by dou y by p y. So right. Uh, Apply Green theorem to star. What is star? In place of uh, u uh, p, we have u. In place of q here minus u. So uh, according to Green theorem, p d x plus q d y equal to q x minus v by. Here in place of p, we have u. That means uh, u v x minus u y into d a. Similarly, we can apply Green theorem to here. We will get uh, u x minus v x. So since f is analytic uh, and it satisfies if every quantity function satisfies Cauchy-Riemann equation, right? So I'm uh, applying Cauchy-Riemann equation to this. Uh, u x equal to v y, u y equal to minus v x. So just I simply substitute this value see here. We'll get u y minus v x, so v y plus i v y minus v y, right? Uh, u y u y get cancelled out. This also get cancelled out. We'll get this zero zero in this over the equal to zero, right? So that means if f I take a uh, f is analytic function, close the quantity C, then This uh, integration over C of J equal to zero, right? Uh, this statement is proved by Cauchy. Now I want to go to prove Cauchy-Gauchard theorem. For proving Cauchy-Gauchard theorem, I required a lemma. A lemma says that uh, let f be analytic on closed contour C, which is enclosed by region R consisting of all points interior to positive oriented simple closed contour. Together with the points on C itself, for any positive number epsilon, the region R can be covered with the finite number of squares and partial squares indexed by j equal to one to n, such that in each of these uh, fixed point j j for which is the inequality hold right. So here the matter says that oh, oh, this is a uh, contour which is enclosed by region. Right, each region or uh, divided into some partial number of finite number of squares and partial squares. So if I divide this, happen uh, here I am taking the z j point is on any square. 
so if i take like this the inequality hold so this inequality require for proving koshi gosha theorem so uh, exam point of view this is important question for koshi gosha theorem so statement what is it says if a function f of z is uh, analytic at all points interior to own and on simple closed contour c the function is uh, analytic interior and on it simple and closed contour c then integration was the f of z dz equal to 0 so i want to prove this only let i am considering let uh, the closed contour c enclosed by region r c i am taking that closed contour c enclosed by region r the region can r can be divided into finite number of partial square so this region can be divided into finite number of partial squares uh, and uh, squares are partial squares what are we? these are the medieval all squares a uh, uh, border we have partial square so after take uh, epsilon be a positive integer for epsilon range 0 by above lemma we will get uh, this inequality integration of object f of z z z minus z z uh, z j minus f of z z is less than epsilon by above lemma so uh, i want to define a function delta z of j that equal to by using this so i'm defining this if z not equal to z j here we have in in this we have z and z j so if z not equal to z j we will get this expression if z equal to z j we will get uh, this so apply more to this uh, more z already nothing but this is nothing but delta j of j which is less than epsilon delta z is continuous so if you means which is less than epsilon which implies what happened delta z of j is continuous so now i am taking this equal to this so i want to multiply this so first multiply then we will get expression f of z equal to f of z j plus this expression so i want to integration over c uh, this way right? where since c is simple close contour so which implies so i want to integration this way okay uh, over simple closed contour c see if i simplify this uh, f of z minus z j so i want to simplify this we will get this uh, okay so since we know that you see simple closed contour any closed contour integration of dz equal to zero why because uh, what is definition of dz dz definition of dz uh, integration of dz equal to z a to b so b minus a it is closed since c a is closed to then what happened a equal to b that equal to 0 similarly you can integration over z dz so this is uh, close simple closed contour so this also will get zero since all analogs it is the odd function so any closed contour c uh, any integration of odd function is uh, will get zero so if i substitute this values in above equation uh, integration f of c f of dz equal to we will get this so finally integration of c f of z equal to this we will get since uh, we can divide region into n uh, squares and partial squares so if i divide given region into n square partial n then what happened addition of c f of z equal to we'll get f of z dz equal to is nothing but summation of integral right so this expression is nothing but already just now we proved so that equal to this so apply try mode both side apply mode so by using trial inequality this mod goes to inside it implies mod x plus y is less than or equal to mod x plus mod y or else mod x1 plus x2 is less than or equal to mod x1 plus mod x that equals summation of mod x you can write here so nothing but so by integration theorem already we know that mod was uh, some lemma already in proved in uh, unit 2 so this mod integration of mod dj equal to you can write it this is so now I'm taking that the length of the each square cj is j. I'm taking that uh, the length of each square cj is length. Right? I'm taking one port. I'm taking that uh, this is so one square is there. The length of this I'm taking sj of contour. The length of contour cj is uh, the c. The whole length of contour c is uh, one side length is j. So whole length is what happened four here, right? The square. So the whole length will be 4 a So the, the length of contour edge CJ is 4 edge. So and if I take triangle inequality, uh, so uh, by Pythagoras theorem, C, this is J, S, J. So uh, if I do diagonal, so this is J, J square. What is the by by using Pythagoras theorem? 
so we will get uh, hypotenuse is equal to this so mod z minus z equal to that equal to 2 root h right the addition between here to here so we are considering z minus z j mod delta j this also uh, this is less than to 2 root j and this is epsilon equal to m i am taking this is uh, m so all let me give that the length of contour is full j right so by applying m as theorem this is equal to m into l m nothing but this and l equal to 4 h if i multiply we will get 4 root h square that equal to epsilon so h j square equal to a j i am taking that uh, the area of square is uh, here a j is area of the square see this is uh, length of contour of uh, square if i take uh, square we will get this expression in place of uh, h a if i take uh, l j sorry the power the partial square is also right uh, uh, we have here uh, partial square here full square this are the partial square if i take this length we will get this so if i take border that means partial square length uh, in place of uh, 4 h j if i take l j i don't know that it means so i am taking this l j therefore the total contour the total length of contour c j does not exceed this thing so how it is this is that equal to this and also you can do again we will then this are equal to 4 root uh, root h j epsilon and uh, l j so if i apply both uh, the means this is both expression is that equal to 2 root, root to h j epsilon plus 4 h j plus l j see if i simplify you will get this expression so uh, overall this will get to this so that means integration over mod j equal to will get uh, this expression if i take uh, let s be as total length right of the enclosed by region and l is the total length of the partial square so so then what happen in place of a i j you will get a square in place of s you will get s in place of i you will get epsilon so we will get i am taking this is epsilon this is only this is k so that means uh, this is one number right i am taking the k so in case mod is less than k epsilon nothing but which is less than epsilon only so we know mod loss of uh, some value which is less than epsilon will imply that here uh, i am writing here minus 0 then what happen so integration of say f of j d equal to 0 right so hence proved cauchy gauchard theorem for example i am taking that uh, uh, integration of say expansion of z cube dz equal to 0 where c is a simple closed contour let c is any simple closed contour f of z equal to expansion of z cube that means uh, this is analytic right so interact on it what are maybe right uh, this is throughout c is analytic function so f of z is so uh, analytic function i mean it is entire function only so that means uh, f of z is analytic and continuous so by using gauchard theorem then what happen if any function is so uh, analytic and closed on uh, on and inside so mm -hmm. the integration of value zero that means uh, by using analytic function uh, by cauchy gauchard theorem this will get to zero right so this uh, and the uh, cauchy gauchard theorem and application